good evening to you around the UK and a very, very good day to you in Australia and Konnichiwa to you in China and Buenos Dias to you in Spain. Um, to tonight and this morning, wherever you are, I also watched on this fine Monday, January evening, um, the sequel to um, to Puss in Boots um, 1, which is Puss in Boots The Last Wish. Now, I didn't quite enjoy this film. I thought 40 started off slow. Um, I honestly think it was a bit poor. Not one of the best sequels anyway, but I'll still read what happens in the film to you tonight. So... Here's what happens in Put in Boots to The Last Wish. When Puss in Boots discovers the that he is press for present for an adventure has take he has taken its toll and he has Burned, banned, burned through eight of his nine lives, he launches an epic journey to restore them by finding the. Hang on. Finding the mystery last wish. Now, obviously, have just now. Obviously, I've just said um, I prefer Puss in Boots one to this sequel because it's a bit. I just found it because of COVID and all that, guys. Sorry, I shouldn't mention it now because we're through the COVID pandemic. But because of COVID, I just feel like this. Put in Boots Last Wish sequel to the first one seemed a bit rushed and a bit quick, should I say. So it wasn't my kind of best sequel to a movie I've ever seen. But if you want to see um, Put in Boots Last Wish, it's available in cinemas now. Buy your ticket, and you'll go and you can go and see the film. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm sorry it wasn't a very positive review this evening but farewell bye for now sleep well